is a miracle. A miracle is God is when God goes against nature. When he does what is humanly impossible. When he does something that people cannot do on their own. That is a miracle. A miracle is when God makes the impossible possible. And I believe that the fact that you're here today, you must have experienced a miracle in your life before. Amen? But I want us to graduate from just having testimonies of last year, testimonies of last month, to talking about testimonies of every day. Praise the Lord. Waking up every day expecting has always shown himself to be a God of miracles. From the very beginning, he called Abraham. Now, I want to say that the reason God does miracles, the children of Israel, and chose Abraham and got him out of other people, he wanted a people that the rest of the world can look at and say, indeed, there is a God. And that purpose of God has not changed. The reason God saved you out of your family, he wants that he will do something in your life that the people who see you will say, we know him, we know where he comes from, we know what he has, we know he is not, he does not have this and this. If it had not been the Lord on his side, there is no way he would have made it to this place. He has not qualified for this job, but God has given it to him. He has not doesn't have big connections, but he has been able to survive. When people look at your life, may your life be a testimony. In the name of Jesus, I pray that people will begin to testify, not because of what God did in the Bible, but people will begin to testify about the God of Andrew, the God of John, the God of Mary, the God of, of, of Ezekiel, the God. People will begin to say, surely there is a God. Surely there is a God. And so God began to do miracles. And sometimes there are situations we go through and they, they seem to be so difficult and they seem to be so hard. But sometimes it is because God wants to do a miracle. Praise the Lord. And sometimes it's because things become harder. You know, when it just reminds me of when the, 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 the three Hebrew boys had refused to bow down and that the king made sure that fire is seven times hotter. That even the people who threw them in the, in the fire, they all were burned by the fire and died. I mean, sometimes life can become so hot and so hard. But sometimes the test is harder that your testimony may be greater. I said sometimes that the, the, the battle is fierce. That when you come out, people will say, if it had not been God, there is no way he would have survived. So one of the testimonies that we see is in Genesis chapter, nine, chapter 18 and verse 9. And, I, and I'll, I'll, read, I'll read several tests because I want you to be activated. I pray that by the time you leave this place today, you are so charged up to receive a miracle from God. A miracle means something that goes beyond even what your salary can pay you. Praise the Lord. You know, sometimes jo jobs are a blessing and jobs are a miracle. But sometimes people live according to what their job can pay them. We leave God out of the equation. You begin to live just, you limit yourself. But God has not told us to live according to our, to our jobs. He has called us to live according to his riches in Hallelujah. So God is able to do much more than you could even imagine. Glory to God. He's able to do much more. 